There's no time to lose, so let's get started. I imagine you probably have a good handle on the cooking side of things already. What you need to pay attention to is remembering each table's order. Try not to get them mixed up. Oh, Pinard's memory is like a steel trap! This is gonna be a cinch! Uh, what chicken are we on again? Table one was onions, but no chilies. Table two was chilies, but no onions. And table three was, uh, table three was chilies, but hold the chilies? Ah! Was Paimon just sleep floating? Ugh. We didn't even get a break in the middle. Paimon's brain has turned to mush. Is it always this busy here? No, but this is peak season. You both did a mighty fine job for your first time serving guests at the inn. Luckily, all our customers were familiar faces this time around, so we didn't get any strange requests. Otherwise, today would have been even more challenging. No strange requests? Someone asked for almond tofu drizzled in soy sauce. Even Paimon has never tried that combination. <laughs> it's a wide world out there. People have all kinds of different tastes. Being able to cater to all is the real essence of Leo cuisine. Also, the thing about requests is that they're usually very specific. So as long as you do what they asked, you're unlikely to have any issues. What's really tricky is when guests give you free reign to do anything you want. Uh, excuse me. Are you still open by any chance? Huh? Paimon knows that voice. <gasps> Let's go check it out! Uh, what should we do? It doesn't look like anyone's here. Uh, if only we'd gotten here a bit sooner. It's all right. If we start building a campfire now, we'll be eating before too long. Right. Besides, if anyone's to blame, it's Linny. So busy being a greedy culture vulture that he lost track of time. Linny, Lynette, Fremenade, it is you! Paimon? So, is the Traveler here? Traveler, Paimon! What a nice surprise! Paimon was gonna say the same thing! We're just lending a helping hand at the inn. Anyway, so that's how we ended up here. But what about you guys? Don't tell us. Uh, father sent you on another mission? No, quite the opposite, actually. We're in Liyue on vacation, and while we're here, I thought a cultural tour might be in order. Uh, uh, father said we deserve some rest after everything that happened recently. Otherwise, it could jeopardize our next mission. It's not every day we get this kind of opportunity. Lenny thought it might be fun to spend some time in Liyue, especially since it's lantern rite season. We could hardly pass up the opportunity to watch a Liyue-style magic show. Although, I think they call it conjuring here. Uh, in our time here, we've seen conjuring tricks incorporated into a Liyue opera show, and even a wushu dance. It was amazing. So, we decided to stay here for a few more days to see what other forms of inspiration this land might have in store for us. We visited Granny Roshin in Chingsa Village not long ago, and today we continued our cultural tour in the area around here. In the end, though, we lost track of time. We haven't even eaten anything yet. <laughs> and speaking of eating... As you know, seafood is a big part of both Liyue and Fontaine cuisine, but it's cooked very differently here. 
We simply had to try some local seafood after coming all this way. That's another reason why we decided to extend our trip. Oh, need any recommendations? What have you tried so far? That fish one with the misleading name. Sounds bland, but it's drowning in hot chilies. Oh, you mean black back perch soup? You're right, the name doesn't give much away. <laughs> it looked and smelled so appetizing that Lynette took a huge mouthful. Blissfully unaware that she was about to set her mouth on fire, she could barely speak for the rest of the day after that. Uh, luckily, that wasn't a huge adjustment for her. <laughs> What? Aren't you guys hungry too? Uh, yes, a little. Uh, <laughs> uh, yes, I'm ready to eat. Traveler, I'm afraid we'll have to send you back to the kitchen now. Hmm, good question. I doubt we'll be able to decipher the menu, so why don't you recommend something? You should be pretty familiar with our tastes. Uh, one more thing. Please, if you have a heart, don't make it spicy. I thought the black back perch stew was actually pretty tasty. And now that you know it's spicy, you won't be caught off guard, right? Why don't we give it another chance? Once was more than enough. <laughs> Fontaine, huh? No wonder they can't handle too much spice. Still... If we make the food too bland, they might as well be eating back home. Hmm... There's this crab and shrimp stir-fry I know that could work. It's quite heavily seasoned, but it's a lot milder than it looks. It has a light but really satisfying flavor. Ooh, that sounds perfect! What's it called? <laughs> well, this is where it gets interesting. They call it the Palace Jewels. The crab roe is supposed to look like pearls of gold, and the shrimp meat like chunks of jade. Here's the recipe. When you're ready, go ahead and give it a try. Crab bro like pearls of gold, shrimp meat like chunks of jade. <laughs> Whoever wrote this recipe had quite the imagination.
ไหวอ่า yes we meant to say you two must be tired after a long day of work do you want to eat with us oh now that you mention it Paimon is a little hungry well if you insist then who are we to refuse <laughs> oh right of course you're still our customers uh why aren't you eating the sauce looks a little overpowering Oh, uh, according to Liyue custom, it's probably good table manners to let someone else go first. <clears throat> Looks delicious, traveler. I guess I'll dig in first. Here goes. What is it? Do you need some water? No, it's delicious. The flavor is so. Sure, it's drenched in sauce, but somehow it just enhances the natural flavor of the seafood. T try it for yourselves. Um. Uh. All right. Mmm. Hmm. <laughs> what is that? Crab roe? Yep. You have quite the palate, Lynette. No wonder it pairs so well with the shrimp meat. I've never seen it prepared this way before. According to the creator, chewy crab, compliment succulent shrimp, making a spectacular seafood ensemble with a succulent flavor and luscious mouthfeel. The crab roe glitters like pearls of gold, and the shrimp shines like chunks of jade. Hence its name, the Palace Jewels. So that's where the name comes from. <laughs> I suppose it's quite fitting then. Huh? Was Paimon always this well spoken? This dish must be right up your alley, Lynette. Uh huh? Ah! Uh, it's half gone already. When did that happen? I heard that in Liyue. The biggest compliment you can pay to the chef is to leave a clean plate. It's delicious. Thank you ever so much. Wait! Don't fight over it. Hey! Leave some for Paimon. I think I'm finally getting the hang of chopsticks. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, Linny and Lynette picked it up in no time, but they're naturally dexterous. Unlike me, it's taken me a lot longer, but I'm slowly getting there. Oh, uh, speaking of chopsticks, in one of the shows we've seen here, someone performed a conjuring trick using a bowl and chopsticks. So if I want to be a good magician's assistant, I need to keep practicing. Lynette's not usually so forthcoming about what she likes, but this time, well, she's expressed it in more ways than one. I guess you've rubbed off on her too. <laughs> Or maybe your cooking is simply too delicious to resist. The next time our paths cross in Fontaine, you'll have to fire up your cooking skills for my other siblings as well. How does that sound, oh great master chef? Oh yeah. <laughs> well then, I'll have to clear my schedule. Uh. Calorie surplus detected. Digestion mode engaged. Yeah. Well, Lenny and I are usually careful about what we eat. Because we have to stay in performance shape. That plus, it's generally bad manners to overindulge at the dinner table. But once in a while, it's nice to treat yourself in the company of family. 
Besides, if I'd waited until my brothers were finished trying to outpolite each other, the food would have gone cold. So your friends like the dish, huh? Well done! Not bad at all for your first day on the job. There'll be more to come, so keep it up. Yeah.